ladies and gentlemen. Many of you may remember this dog when Karen, that looked high and deranged and out of her mind, threw her puppy at this black man after just starting some argument that made absolutely no sense whatsoever. Well, he has officially adopted this dog. And he already had a dog named Pluto at home and said the two dogs are getting along just fine. You know, I know shortly after this happened, he had posted a video on Instagram and he was running around with the dog and the dog just seemed so happy. He was just running behind him and having a good time. So this came out in the Daily Mail, October 28th, 2020. It was something out of a movie. Man was attacked by deranged Karen who threw an adorable puppy at him said he's thankful for the ordeal because he now adopted the dog and named her Movie. So ladies and gentlemen, this puppy, you know, at first I thought it maybe it was a mixed breed. No, this is a full breed. And it is a Belgium Malinois. Okay. So he named her movie, Abel Gashu, 20, told DailyMail.com that he was accosted by a disturbed woman as he sat in his car in Los Angeles on October 10th, was shocked when she threw her puppy she was carrying at him. He filmed the incident and it went viral after he posted it online. I was sitting in my car, parked. She popped up out of nowhere, he said. She was holding the dog and talking about some kind of political stuff. I don't even know what she was saying. She started hitting my car, so I started recording. Then she reached in through my window and tried to slap me. Wow. Yeah, I remember when all of this happened because I did a story on it. And he said, that's how it all began. When I, I said to her, if the dog was hers, she threw it at me. I was just angry. It didn't make sense to me. I didn't do anything to provoke her. Gashu told DailyMail.com. You don't have to do anything to promote, uh, provoke these people. You don't have to do a thing. Historically, we already know that. His first, uh, his first thoughts was to protect the puppy, despite the woman continuing to berate him with mad ramblings and racist insults. She was definitely racist. And before I recorded, she was talking about how I was black and in a Mercedes. He said, oh, she didn't like you in that expensive car, huh? No surprise. I'm really confused about her. I don't know what to think. I can't tell if she was on drugs, she were really drunk or mentally ill. It's hard to tell what the situation is in the moment. I felt bad for her, but once she threw the dog, then it got serious. The first thing I did was pick up the dog, make sure she was okay and took her with me. I named her Movie. It just fit because of the situation. It was unreal, like something out of a movie. Her life is a lot better now. It's kind of like a happy ending. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Gashu said, the lucky movie has settled into her new life and is now firm friends with her with his other dog, a Pomeranian Husky named Pluto. A video obtained by the DailyMail.com shows the two puppies playing in Gashu's kitchen, tails wagging. The Chicago rapper said he was inundated with offers of financial support for movie from both friends and strangers when his video 
of the bizarre and distressing incident went viral. There are a lot of people hitting me up where to send donations. I didn't answer anyone because it was too much. So I set up a GoFundMe, he said. The charity page has now raised over $8,000 for movie. Gashu said he plans to move to LA with his two dogs where movie can continue her life have a uh, happily ever after. That's very sweet. You know, so I guess at the end of the day, it was lucky for that dog that she encountered him. So ladies and gentlemen, this is the update. But you know, it reminds me of another story from a couple of years ago where um, I had a friend that I was working with and somebody tied a dog to a stop sign and just left the dog, just left the dog. And it was a hot summer day and he didn't know who, you know, it, it was no kind of identity on the dog. The person just tied him to this stop sign and just left him there. And he said a couple of hours later, he went by again and the same dog was tied to the stop sign. So he got out of his car, untied it and just took the dog with him. Well, the dog must have been, uh, I guess somebody just decided they didn't want him no more. And that's what they did. You know, there were no signs. He even called the shelter to see if somebody was missing a dog, nothing. So he did the same thing. He officially adopted the dog and kept that dog until he died. I tell you, it, it by chance, you never know <laughs> how you may end up with a pet. But y'all, please tell me what you think. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.